Hi, I'm Kristen with Appalachian Headwaters, and today we are working to maintain our native plant along our hillside, protecting against erosion for our construction of our new building here. Cool seasoned grasses, like our fescues over here, see how they're not a bunch grass? It's like one it, It's band. spreading, yeah. So yeah. it'll have like rhizomes that are spreading out. Okay. And it's also still green because it's the cool season, right? Okay. So the cool season grasses are what we want to get rid of today. And we're going to leave our bunch grasses like these guys here. Right. So after we clear our hillside of invasive grasses and non-native plants, we will supplement the seed bank with a mixture here of native plants. You can see some of them are even germinating. Some of the species that we have in here are Gara, Evening Primrose, Columbine, Senna, and Bush Pea, which are great for early successional plants that will maintain anti-erosion effects on this hillside. So we're scratching up the soil a little bit, so that way there are places for our seeds to get covered into little nooks and crannies. And if Michael wants to, he can cover that up. It's also okay there. Didn't have anywhere for the seeds to go. They might just blow away or be eaten by insects and birds. So now they're covered up and they're protected. By exposing the soil on our hillside of native plants, we are allowing for the seeds that are wind dispersed in our area, like this common milkweed, to land on bare ground and establish. Each of these flowery, puffy, fluffy seeds has a way to blow around in the wind, like you can see. And the tiny little brown seed there will land on the ground and hopefully germinate when it gets wet from tomorrow's rain. 